The weather did not stop Veterans Day tributes across the metro. The annual ceremony, usually held at Omaha's Memorial Park, moved indoors to American Legion Post 1. And KTV News Watch 7's Joe Beth DeVera takes us there. It was a packed house at American Legion Omaha Post 1 Wednesday morning. Benson High Color Guard kicked off the Veterans Day ceremony. <laughs> City and military leaders like U.S. Stratcom Lieutenant General Stephen Wilson addressed the crowd, commemorating the service of so many, taking a moment to recognize the support system for members of the military. It's the family members who really truly understand all the things that are going on. Within our families. Then the placing of the wreaths in honor of those who've served and currently serve. While it was a celebration for our vets, it was also a time for them to reflect. Always remember that landing on Iwo Jima. John A. Dickinson is a World War II and Korean War vet. At 90 years old, his time in the Marines is still fresh in his memory. We went aboard the little landing crafts at 5 o'clock in the morning. After we had had our steak and eggs for breakfast, and we bobbed around out there, and a lot of us got seasick. All around the room, smiles and tears on this day dedicated to our country's heroes. This ceremony makes me very proud of our country and of the men and women who have served and who will continue to serve. In Omaha, Joe Beth Devera, KETV News Watch 7.